Good morning, everybody. As promised, I'm gonna give you a tour of the hotel today. It's big. There's like four floors and there's no sense in the matter. You just take turns left and right. It's a, it's a good analogy to how Costa Rica really is. The roads, they are crazy. And the people are crazy. And the buildings are crazy. So, let's get started. So this is in the hotel. They have an outdoor swimming pool with this really nice garden area. And then up here, they have another really cool thing. I am thoroughly lost. This hotel is a maze. I have no idea where I am and I don't know how to get back. Here's the cafeteria. It's where we eat. So apparently there's a workout room on the fourth floor that's amazing. So I'm gonna go check it out. Fourth floor. I made it to the top floor. This is our hotel. Big, it just seems disjointed, but it's very fancy. It's like a villa. This is the workout room. It's on the fourth floor, and it's smaller than I thought. Check it out. But this is where you can go to get jacked. Ugh, look at that mini muscle. I should. I might as well. It'll be fun. That was pretty good, don't you think? So they have these cool things by the elevators. Press it. You can polish your shoes. Did I tell you? I lost my wallet at the airport, which kind of freaked me out a lot. We were riding the bus back from the airport to where we were gonna rent our car. And I was feeling around for my wallet and I couldn't find it. Um, they ripped apart all my stuff, looked for it, they couldn't find it. So I went back to the airport and there it was. It had fallen out of my pocket because I gave dollar, so I gave Bradley a dollar. And luckily we found it, because otherwise I'd be in trouble. I had, I'm doing very bad at keeping my things secure. I have already lost my wallet, I lost my phone, and the GoPro, um, and I've locked myself out of the room. And it's only day one. <laughs> it hasn't even been a day. Go me. So, some advice, don't lose your wallet in a foreign country. We are off to see a waterfall. Yeah. Stay right there. The further into the mountain we go, the more jungle-like it becomes. Pretty cool, isn't it? You guys said 20 minutes ago. I mean, it says it says 11 minutes. I don't believe that because the speed limit is 40 kilometers. We made it to the waterfall. It's really easy because we parked right there. Look at that. Oh, that's where they are. There's some yeah, people up there. Path up there. You see it? Yeah. So we can't hike here. The hike is not that part. The hike doesn't start there, it starts up there. We have to go around and up to the top. Amateurs. Now we made it to the real hiking spot. We don't know when it closes, so we're gonna go find out. Look at the hummingbirds. Hello guys, you guys are so cute. This waterfall isn't just a waterfall, it's an entire zoo. They have a, a bird place right here, and monkeys, and monkeys, and waterfalls. It's pretty cool. Hey Mr. Birdie, how you doing? See the way he jumped? <laughs> Hola! Come with us, Birdie! We will free you! No, we won't. That's a lie. Look at those cheaters taking a shortcut. 
Let's do that. Hear that? That's the faint sound of a waterfall. We're pretty close. I'm racing my mom and family back to the top. I beat them. I did it. Now I just have to wait for the bus to get here. They decided to go back up. I didn't want to, mainly because it was uphill the whole time. Look at that foot leaf. Uh, it's massive. Wow. So, what happened, mom? It's really steep, by the way. It won't let us go further. What? That's terrible. Good job, Bradley. You did good. You made it all the way. You no, know I could do it, but I did. I'm proud of you. We all are. A bozone. Bozone. You have to push in. So, what are your thoughts about the hike? Hey, that was really fun. They should have let us go back. They should have. They did. But they did. Sad. Everybody is just dying to see the monkeys. That's where everybody's going. And we have to get there before it closes. It's like 4.45 and it closes at 5. So let's go see them monkeys. Like, <laughs> <laughs> hey, you guys, stop fighting. So where's the, um, stop fighting? Oh. <laughs> Long live the, the king. king. I haven't even looked at the other monkeys. Oh. Hey, buddy, how you doing? You think I'm already groom you. Oh, thank you, bud. Oh. 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 Oh, don't let her pull your finger in. You really could bite it. No, 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 she can bite it. You're so pretty. Okay. Wait, did you say to lick my fingers afterwards? Yeah. No. So, yes, that was adorable, but right after we were done, I realized it said a big sign, do not touch the monkeys. I'm like, oh, whoops. So, hopefully... I will be safe. We're all gonna come down with jungle fever or something like that. Let's go to the butterfly place. Butterflies! Flutterby. We are in the, the butterfly museum. They're too fast to get on camera. And if there's one of them, you need to stop flying and attack butterfly. Attacks. Attacks me like crazy. Stupid attack butterflies. Cool. You are the most majestic attack butterfly ever. They just leave the cocoons out in the open. There's no glass or anything to protect them. We are on our way to go find the jungle cats. Ooh, buff that. Ooh, the cats. Hi, pretty. You sleep a lot, don't ya? Wow, look at them. 
Bradley's telling me to hurry. So we gotta hurry. Okay, now I'm here. I just jumped up there. Whoa. Baby. Hey, bud. Do you want to tell you something on my finger? Can I see yourself? Look. Can you see yourself? Is that kind of cool? Wow. I'm pretty sure it, there should be a sign that says, hey, don't put your fingers up there. There was a sign on the monkeys that said that. Yeah. Look at the baby. Her paws. Hey, buddy. That's separate. the baby. They keep them separate according to this Isn't thing right so here. Isn't he so cute? I really want to touch it, like, really bad, because I want to say I've touched the... I know. I'll touch his back leg. I will half your face. Okay, I'll touch that. that You're taking the young. I think we'll call it a day. That was a good day, good adventures. We'll send you off with a good view of the wilderness. I think one of the benefits yeah, of going to a foreign country are out. the lax laws that they have. It'll make a window. Uh, like some of those things that we were doing, they wouldn't let us do. Can you like stay half an hour after the closing time? Like yeah, that or some of the paths they would they would have deemed too dangerous for Americans. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And the monkeys they would have had them boxed off. So we couldn't even. Well, they have multiple through. fences so that we weren't. The we're monkeys put their hands all the way through. I know. You got a car back to us. The guy in the front was waving along. Yeah. Meow, meow. I said that that was the end of the vlog, but I lied. This is the end of the vlog.